Like, you had to get back in line, but you could, like, keep doing it. But the line wasn't that bad, they said. That's good, then. But I think they're letting just normal pass holders go before everyone else, too, but you have to wait. It's like after the people that got the special preview, like the very first one. Really? Yeah, so we got you for Bush Gardens. You can go like certain weekends for different pass types, but then Robert and I are going the weekend before all that starts. Nice. Or like a day before it all starts or something like that. So we get the first like preview before everyone else since we got those three visits and then it's like the rest of the past members who didn't get the visits can go and do it so i think sea world's doing the same that's pretty cool they emailed me for like our pass and lewis's fun card but it's on a monday and tuesday i'm like who can do that yeah i can't so yeah I was like, and I was oh like, God. for Iron Gwazi though, I was like, if I have to take a day off work, I'm gonna do it. Oh yeah, for sure. I don't care that much for Icebreaker. Iron Gwazi's gonna be intense. I'm so excited. There's like so much coming out too, because you got the Vlogs posters that like just came out, I still haven't gotten to go on. Bruh. The Iron Gwazi, Icebreaker, you got like Guardians of the Galaxy soon, I think. And the Tron, Tron coaster. Yeah. The Lasso coaster is so intense. <laughs> like, so intense. <sighs> I want to go on it so bad. It's fun. It's, it's a little scary, though. Can't lie. I always get a little like freaked out before riding a coaster for the first time, but I usually end up fine. And it's not like I've ever had an issue with them, so. Yeah, exactly. I was kind of scared on a Velocicoaster, coaster. I can't lie. I cannot lie. <laughs> I went with my friend Sam on the Tower of Terror. Oh my gosh. And she was like, I'm scared. And I was like, have you been on this before? She's like, yeah, we went on it two days ago. I was like, why are you freaking out if you literally just went on just it? Just went on it, yeah. Literally just went on it. That ride, isn't, that ride doesn't scare me. I think it's pretty fun. Yeah, I mean, I like it. Robert likes it, but it's like everyone else we seem to go with hates it. I love it. I was so excited because the last time we wrote it was like in wow. May or something. You did not get too much luck in there. I've only been to Hollywood Studios. Like, oh gosh, there's like three people over here. Two or three. They might be bots, so. Yeah, they are. I love Hollywood yeah. Studios. I've only been a couple times. I'd like to go and actually like ride everything. I haven't been on everything. We're both there right away. Well, you'll definitely have to go again sometime. Yeah. Once we get stuff paid off and moved out and like settled in and Gotta bring it up to Lewis. Well, that's if they start selling passes again. I'm sure they will, I just don't know when. That's why I'm like, if we decide not to renew, we're gonna like, screw ourselves because who knows when they're gonna sell them again. Yeah. It's just so much money. It is. We're gonna that's why downgrade. Yeah, we're gonna downgrade our pass, but only save $2. Wow. Because of how much prices have gone up. That is crazy. That's why I'm like, let's just get Universal, because that's like $19 a month instead of me paying. We pay like 55 now. Oh my gosh. Yeah, like a person or together? A person. Oh, man. 
Yeah. And it's so crowded. Like, I'm excited to go, but I'm like, having anxiety too. <laughs> this is gonna be my I mean, first time fun. going to like a big park with two kids without Lewis. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's fun, but like, I don't know. It's just been pissing me off lately. Yeah. I'm excited though, because like, we have like the the hotel so if it gets too overwhelming we can just go hang out but we're gonna go for the fireworks and i haven't seen the new fireworks yet we've seen them at epcot played... but we haven't seen the magic kingdom one i haven't yeah. seen magic kingdom fireworks since before covid so i'm pretty excited yeah i want to go see the new show but i'm like i can't get myself to go and deal with that crowd i know i think the only reason i'm okay with it is since we have the hotel <laughs> Yeah, getting out of there is crazy, so it's like if you stay on in a hotel that you can like get to easily and you don't have to like drive, that'd be great. Yeah. Mm. I think we just have to take a bus to Corando. I'm not really too sure. I've never stayed there, so. Yeah, I dropped my friend Sam off there the one night and I was like, how do you even find anything around here? She's like, oh, it's huge and I don't know where I'm going. Yeah, I'm linking it all up to Ashley and the other girl, because I'm like, I don't know what we're doing. I know the parks, that's about it. Right. I don't stay on Disney property, so you can't ask me anything about their hotels. Yeah, it's expensive. It is. I mean, it's like on my bucket list. I at least want to stay at one one time yeah. I, just, I can never get myself to spend that much money because there's three of us like three months and it was 200 bucks a person and they paid more than i did because i know they weren't being honest with me about how much it was i paid 200 i don't know how much they paid for two nights i think she upgraded our room too I feel like it's more than that, though. It's... Oh, yeah. Well, it, 200 was just me, like, contributing, but I think it was, like, almost 400 at night. But I was like, I have to buy peak day tickets, so already between tickets and my part of the hotel is 500 bucks, so I can't be going all crazy. Yeah. That's, like... Sam and Wilson, I asked how much they spent because that's where they stayed. And I think they, they say like 1200 for a week. How many nights? For a week? Yeah. Can't pick up Lola. Katie? Oh yeah, I can't either. Oh yeah, I I was like, we stayed for two nights in a hotel and I spent $169. I just found it. can't pick up anything over here, that's weird. Right? That's how I am. Uh, we like the Katie. Holiday Inn, like across from, uh, what is it? Uh, oh, like Fun Spot? No. Oh, Fun Spot. I don't know. One of those park, little park Old things town. off the side. Old Town. We always stay off property. <laughs> we stayed last time and Lewis was like, um, this room's really small. And it was. But it was fun. Cause we stayed at Pop. I know, I was looking at those and I was like, well, this is probably the only one I could stay at. It was nice, though. It would be nice, like, if we're just seeing Robert, but, like, with kids and everything, it was a little small. Yeah. I don't know, I looked, because my mom was like, well, what do you guys plan on doing for, like, a honeymoon? I was like, I have no idea, it's freaking cold. Like, when I think <laughs> of honeymoon, I'm like, let's go sit on a beach and be a bum all day. Yeah. So I'm like, what am I supposed to do? It's cold outside. I can't go to a different state because it'd probably be snowing and I'll die. Yeah. Because <laughs> I'm a wimp when it comes to snow. There's a vehicle here. Oh my goodness. You get blown away. Um, but then she's like, oh, you guys could just go to Disney. And I was like, maybe there's an excuse to stay on property, but... Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> well, I don't know. I guess it'll depend how much we actually spend on yeah. a wedding. I think my mom might buy my dress, though. Because she oh, was really? like, yeah, we could probably go nice. soon. I was like, mom, I don't have money for a dress right now. She's like, 
Really? Oh, like gave me a look and I was like, oh, you're gonna buy it? She's like, I might. I'm like, all right. Uh-oh. I was say, usually like most of the weddings I've been in, the mom buys it, but like, I wouldn't know, so. <laughs> like, yeah, I mean, I'm absolutely have... clueless. Like, I never really yeah. thought I'd get married, so this is all new to me. Like, and my dad's actually the one that found that expo thing. Oh, really? Oh, that's cute. <laughs> so yeah, I'm like, oh, you want to come with? <laughs> He's probably like, no. <laughs> That would be cool though. Check it out. Yep. I'm sure you might be able to get like some ideas for stuff too. Yeah, I mean... Well, Lewis was like, and I were talking about it, yep. and I was like, well, well, at least I'm sure learn at least one thing. Like, right, at least I one. mean, she hasn't done a wedding since, you know, I think she got married in like 91. So. Like I said, She's like, I don't know. But it depends on like what y'all want. See, yeah, I'm clueless, so I'm hoping going to this thing will help me out some. Are you guys still doing it in Robert's Grand Yard or no? Yeah. Yeah. Just because I don't have to worry about paying for a venue. Yeah, for sure. Um, I'll talk to Lewis and see if they go far. Um, but we have people that you can rent like tables and chairs from, and it's really not that expensive, like compared to like other places. Yeah, up on us. All right. I mean, it's in Land of Lakes, so. Land of Lakes, yeah. I'll ask him to ask if they'll go that far. Or if they Well, do. my mom was like, oh, we could probably get the family together and get like tables and chairs from everyone, or at least chairs, and then like get like whatever the fabric is you put over them to make them look better. And I'm like, Mom, that's so oh, yeah. ghetto. Like, <laughs> <laughs> No, like, it's it's really not that expensive. I have to ask him, depending on how many people you guys are inviting. Listen, this is going to be a what? lot more than I want. Oh, is it? <laughs> because my family, just like all my family, because I have the knot. I made a website on there. Yeah. Or, yeah, like, so I made an account. So I do, like, my guest list on there. And I put, like, my family and our friends, and then, like, his parents and his grandma. Most of his family's in Ohio, so I don't know who he wants to invite. But we're already at, like, 55 people. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's gonna be a lot of people. Which is also why I'm like, yeah, his yard is like perfect because then you don't gotta worry about all the stupid COVID rules and yeah. Oh my God, what I do that? Mask. It's okay. I threw one straight at Amanda earlier. <laughs> <laughs> I was just trying to eat a tomato and I was like, wait, why is she on fire? <laughs> it's okay. We all do that. I've been playing GTA with Robert too, so now I'm all confused on like what I'm doing with my controls and stuff. Right. I haven't played GTA in so long. We just have so much fun on there. It's boring I need to, fast. I need to turn on my PlayStation. I haven't turned nothing on in months. I think it's yeah. easily at least five months. Because my controller Yeah, we haven't even played. Haven't. We haven't even played Fortnite much recently. I haven't, like, before today. It was like a month ago, the last time I played Fortnite. Oh, really? Well, we played yes yesterday, yeah, oh, for a little bit. And I called Brett, and I was like, Brett, you want to get on Fortnite? And he was like, might as well. And I was like, wow. He like, actually okay. said yes. So we played like four matches. We won three of them. And then Brett's like, you want to come to dinner with us? <laughs> Just invite yeah, us. Funny. Doesn't even like tell my parents. It's funny. And he was like, yeah, you know, I invited my own sister to dinner since you guys don't want to. <laughs> Dang, called out. <laughs> they just went to IHOP though. I love IHOP. It was like Lewis so not... empty. Going there for was dinner it? is great. Like no one is there. Lewis is not a big breakfast person, but I'm like always forcing him to go to breakfast places. Well, IHOP has normal food. Yeah. I love breakfast. 
Like, give me all the hash browns, all the bacon. I swear. That's how I am. And they're, they have those Mexican tres leches pancakes. They are so good. Oh, that does sound good. Where are these people? They just have, like, vanilla sauce and caramel on them. Brett's still eating? Like, what is this man doing? Well, He's in the bathroom, I'm sure. Someone yeah. threw a flare over there. Mm -hmm. What do you say? They're having tacos? Tacos sound really good right now. We're making tacos tonight. I'm so excited. Oh. Alright, go to Taco Bell across the street. <laughs> we don't have stuff to make tacos. We were at the store last night and we were like, hey, you wanna make tacos? And we're just kinda like, eh, I don't really wanna make it. Every time that so I get lazy. groceries, we want everything but what we bought. Every single time. Oh, there's a person right here. We are so lazy that, like, we eat like we're teenagers. Like, so much just box pasta and mac and cheese. Same. Because it's easy. It's like he. Someone's gonna find you. Uh, you Good her, Mike. <laughs> My headset died. Yeah, I hear you. I heard there you through, um, no Robert. It's her controller. You can't get me where yeah, I have to use my controller as my headset now. Hey, I can still hear you. That's pretty cool, though. It works pretty good. Just like that. I just hit you a lot of times. Oh, it's you not. Red guy. That's you why my sound bar isn't on. Told you. This has oh, been the most so quiet loud. game. Over here. Are you going to be able to hear my TV through this, too? I don't hear it. It picks up sound like crazy. I need to turn my phone off. This is. Someone just shot me. Where? 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 Oh. I didn't even see anybody. Got him. Nice. Wow, trios, Lance. When do we do that? Right. 